Too good, too good. Looking forward to your audition? Yeah. Who you got here? It's my son, Kian, my mum, Jess. Hi, Kian, you're right. You looking forward to your dad's audition? <laughs> you excited? <laughs> My name's Jowsy Freeland, I'm 26 and I'm from Wolverhampton. I've got a little boy, his name's Kian, he's four years old now. When I look at him, he just lights up my life. Being a father is the best thing ever. <laughs> the first time, you know, I laid eyes on him, I just, just something, something just changed inside him. I mean, my whole perspective on life changed completely. What's your favourite song? Come on. No, you know what your favourite song is? Yeah. It's a moon's like Jagger, isn't it? Yeah. You can sing that as well, can't you? Yeah. Me and his mum broke up. Uh, not, not long back. So he doesn't live with me, unfortunately. I do really miss that. I miss living with him. Dad. Ever since he was born, I've, you know, I've been wearing him every day. And sometimes, you know, come back from work to empty flats. There's just me there, and you know, I've got his pictures wearing and that sort of thing, and it's it's, it's heartbreaking, yeah. Okay, guys, we ready yeah. to go through. Sweet, Do you want to get all your things? Should we take over? Yeah. You're staying here. You're going that way. Good luck, fella. There's so much riding on this for me. It's not just for myself, not just because I want to be a musician, but because I really want to make my son proud. I really want to make him happy. And uh, I'll be proud of his daddy. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Hello. What's your... <laughs> What's your name? My name's Joseph Whelan. And where are you from? I'm from Wolverhampton. How, how old are you? I'm 26. 26. 26. And what do you do for a living? I'm a tool salesman. I go into uh, building sites and smash things up with tools. <laughs> This is brilliant, man. <laughs> Why have you come to the X Factor today? Um, well, I've been playing in bands for about 10 years now, and I really want to do something on my own. And also, I've got a four-year-old son as well, and I want to do the best I can for him and give him the best life I can. Aww. Yeah, he's really lovely as well. Okay, take it away. Right, Daddy got a good voice? Yeah. Good singer? You need cooler, baby, I'm not fooling. I'm gonna send you back to school and way down inside. Woman, you need it. I wanna give you my love. Attention. That's it. <laughs> Joseph, that was a brilliant audition. You've got an amazing talent. You've got an authentic rock voice. Thank you. Thanks so much.
Gary, did you like it? Do you know what? The, the, the best thing about this audition, Joseph, was that when you came on, my name's Joseph Whelan, and then you start to sing, it's... It's just absolutely awesome. What a great voice. I really enjoyed that. Thanks, Gary. It means a lot, man. It means a lot. Thank you. Now, you smashed it. Yeah, you're really hot. You've got great tattoos, and you smash things up with tools, oh, and then you sing. And then you sing. Done. Hey, now we're going to vote, Joseph. I'm going to say... Yes. Joseph. Definitely biggest yes of the day. Thank you. Definitely yes. Thank you. <laughs> Joseph, four big yeses. Well done. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Well done, fella. Brilliant. Well done. Great job. But he's so likeable and so nice and so real. Very likeable. Talented. He's one to watch, guys. He's the best thing in my life, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah. You know that, don't you? He's got his little boy. Three years old. My dad sat me down, and that was the beginning of music for me. My parents loved that I played music, but didn't necessarily want that to be my career. But I decided to move away from my family in Buffalo, move out to New York City to pursue music. It has not been an easy road. I was playing bars and clubs where people were out to party, and it quickly became what would be my undoing. You know, drinks after work, which led to drugs. It was the darkest time of my life. My dad's a man of few words, but I could tell that I disappointed him as his only son. I was ashamed, I was embarrassed, I was worthless. Like, my dad hasn't seen me perform since I was a kid. That's crazy, you know? Now he's getting older and has a tough time getting around. I was scared that I mean, that would end up never seeing me perform. This competition isn't just about me succeeding, it's about proving to my dad that I am worth something and that I'm... This is what I was meant to do. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm very well, how are you? Very good. What's your name? Justin Rhodes. Justin. What will you be doing for us today? I will be singing Wake Me Up by Avicii. Ooh, I like oh, that. Nice song. I like that song a lot. And are you here by yourself today, or you have anyone supporting you today? My dad's here today. Hi, Dad. <laughs> this is your fan group. They're always trouble with you? No, my dad has uh, never really seen me perform as an adult. This is the first time he's seen me on a stage. Aww. So that's why, why has your father never seen you perform before? That sounds strange to me. Uh, I live in Florida now, and he lives up in Buffalo, and uh, it's get a little harder for him to get around. Well, enjoy this moment. Thank you very much. Have fun. I love that song. So let me up when it's all over. When I'm up and I'm older. All this time I was finding myself, but I
loved listening to your voice. You took me on your journey. I really, really liked it. I think you're very special. Your voice has a certain tone to it. It's sexy, you're sexy, and you're pitch perfect. Thank you. It's great. Thank you. Well, she, see, she's hot too. Okay. She's hotting her. And these two will take you home, believe me. <laughs> Howard. Yeah, Justin, I agree with the other judges. I think you have a beautiful tone to your voice. You know, you are able to come out here and convey something through your song. And I'd love to hear more from you. Howie, what did you think? I'll tell you what I thought. You know, I'm a comedian and I'm a husband, but first and foremost, I'm a father. And you said that your father's having a tough time right now getting around. And it's a miracle that he can be here and witness his son's life blossom in front of America. You did something right, sir. And you should be very proud. And what a, you know, I'm a little choked up to watch this, but you did phenomenal. And I'm proud of you, and you're not my son. Thank you so much. Thank you. Let's vote. For me, it's a yes. Thank you. Thank you. I'm a very exuberant yes. Oh, it's a definite yes. How are you? You know. You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to vote for your father. What do you think he would say? I don't know. What does he say? What do you say, sir? Yes! Hello there. Hello. What's your name? I'm Sam Kelly. And how old are you, Sam? I'm 19 years old. And have you got a girlfriend? No, I don't have a girlfriend. Oh. <laughs> and what would winning the show mean to you? <laughs> uh, pretty much everything. I grew up in uh, rural Norfolk, farming background, and never really fitted in <laughs> with the working bracket of my family because I'm pretty much useless at everything except music. <laughs> so, um, and do they know you're here today? Uh, my sister's here, and <laughs> my mum knows I'm here, yeah. And what does she think about you doing this? I think she'll kill you if you don't let me through. Really? <laughs> as far as she's concerned, I am the best musician in the world. Let's hear what you've got. Thank you. You know, it's, 
It's the way you approach the song. It was so delicate. It felt really genuine and honest. And that was a beautiful moment. So well done. <laughs> I don't know what it was, but I've never kind of felt quite so moved. Yeah, it was, it was beautiful. Good lad. Good comments, this. Um, I think uh, when you tackle a song like that, it's not just, you know, your voice. It's the way you make us believe that you've lived every line of that song. I was completely blown away. Thank you. I've got to tell you, Sam, when you've got absolute silence in a room like this, you've nailed it. I think you've got an amazing voice. Um, it's a yes from me. Lisa? It's a yes from me. Well done. I loved it, yes. Well, Sam, your mum's 100% right. That's a yes to me. Well done. <laughs> you had every single one of them in the palm of your hand. You really oh, did. Thank you. How was that? My name is Al Calderon. I'm 19 and I'm from Long Island, New York. My family is the world to me. Can you love me? Ah. My mom is a sales analyst at a veterinary lab. My dad is a sanitation worker for the city of Glen Cove. So what are you going to do when you get on that stage? You're going to take a, take a deep breath and, and do it. My dad is such a proud papa. I'm so lucky to have him. Believe your heart, This is what you love to do. I can't see myself doing nothing else. I work as a host in a restaurant. And I am the designated happy birthday singer at my job. I don't want to work there anymore. <laughs> I really don't. I'm finished. Everybody needs to see Al Cal do it big, baby. Winning this competition would open so many doors to me. Oh, your eyes are gorgeous. Thank you. Oh, my God, I cannot believe this is real right now. Oh, my God, oh my God. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, man. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm great, what's your name? My name's Al Calderon. Nice, how old are you? I'm 19. 19? Yeah. Do you have a job? I am the designated happy birthday singer and host at a restaurant. Everybody grabs me. <laughs> they know. They're like, I see a candle, and they're like, Al, come on, come on. Do you have a girlfriend? No. You don't? <laughs> <laughs> so what are you going to sing for us today? Uh, Sarah Smile by Hall & Oh, my God, I love the song. Yeah. Take me out on a date. Let's go. Let's go. 
I'm down, let's go. We don't have a time machine. <laughs> Simon. Okay, you of all people should not be talking about time machine. <laughs> Machines don't even travel that far back in time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to vote now. Okay, Demi. You know, I have a feeling you're not gonna be working at that restaurant anymore, so say <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> yes. Alina. Buenísimo, buenísimo, bravo. Sí. Gracias, thank you so much. Kelly. I really like you. I like Thank everything you. about you. I think that you really do have an X Factor. Thank you so much. It's so cute, you're turning red. Yes. <laughs> there were some tuning issues on that song. But I'm gonna put that down to inexperience and nerves. The potential of your voice coupled with the way that you look, your charisma. I believe the music business is waiting for someone like you right now. Four yeses, congratulations. Thank you so much, thank you, thank you. Thank you. My name is Matt Linnan. I'm 28 from South End Essex. For a living, I'm a plasterer. The job is not very exciting. Basically, slapping mud on walls. It's very mundane, boring, hot, sweaty, kind of like now. That's definitely not what I want to do at all. He's good looking, isn't he? Did you say he's really disappointed? Are you single? Yes. How Hi. are you? How you doing? All right, thank you. So, what's your name? My name's Matt Linnan. Okay. How old are you, Matt? 28. Okay. What do you do for a living? I'm a plasterer slash musician. Great. You married? No. No. So, you're all solo? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah. So, why here? Why this time? I've been involved in music and worked really hard with various bands and stuff I've been in. I feel like now's the time to come on the show and, and show you guys what I've got. All right, so let's see what you got. Can I be honest with you? Yeah. We've had so many singers like you over the years. And it's not because you're not a good singer, you are a good singer. I think if you're not writing your own material, I think this is really, really tough. Yeah. I do. You know, I like the gravelly voice that you've got, the smoky voice. Are you nervous? I've not been in this situation. 
um, before. Do you look at the floor when you perform with your bands? No. So you know, why not look at us? I mean, we're gorgeous, aren't we? Yeah, very beautiful, very beautiful. Good answer. Matt, uh, blue eyes. I really like the texture and tone of your voice. I just want to connect with you more. I think if you, oh, just open that face and those eyeballs, you can make any girl just melt. <laughs> if you just yeah. really mean it. Yeah, cool. I think you're really talented. I think you need a break. I'm saying yes. Thank you very much. I I'm gonna say yes, I want to see you again, definitely. Nick? Oh, please own it. Own it and work it. I believe in you, I'm gonna say yes. Cool, thank you very much. You got four yeses. Thank you very much. What up? Cheers. Take care. Right. Listen to what we just said, yeah, right? Yeah, I'm taking your advice. Thank you. He looks so good. Hello. Hello, guys. How are you? How you doing? Fantastic. Thanks for having me. Good lord, your dream boat. <laughs> yeah, my eyes lit up. What's your name, dream boat? My name is Trevor Holmes, and I'm, <laughs> I'm 27 years old, and I'm from Thousand Oaks, California. What's your story? Do you work? I'm actually doing construction right now, which I'm not fond of, but I'm doing it to help support my mom. She suffers from lupus, so I'm a part-time songwriter, part-time construction worker, wanting to be full-time musician. Uh, but sometimes you got to pay You're the bills. You're so hot. Oh. <laughs> You're like... This isn't real. <laughs> no, I mean, here's the thing. First yeah. of all, like, only hot guys are typically named Trevor. Is that right? Yeah, well, that's like, one of the names. Trevor, he's hot. He does construction on the side, and he loves his mom. I do, very much so. Um, Trevor. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Don't call me ma'am. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just, I respect you so much. And... Don't respect me. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't respect me. She don't want you being nice. <laughs> don't, respect me. don't respect me. <laughs> oh, thank you, God. <laughs> <laughs> Katie, this is the man you need. Listen, Quit if you're not going me. to Hollywood, maybe you can just come hang out with me. <laughs> Are you engaged? No. Cool. <laughs> I do have a girl. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I hope you can sing. Katie is cheering for you. Uh. Well, I can't count the times Almost it was on my mind That I couldn't Calm down. <laughs> And just the other day, I wrote down all the things I'd say, but I couldn't. I just couldn't. Don't look at me. And baby, I know you've been wondering. Oh, so here goes nothing. In case you didn't know, Katie, I'm crazy about you. <laughs> nice. I would be lying if I said that I, I can't protect this life you from him. You. Yeah, even though I don't tell you all the time, you had my heart a long, long time ago. In case you didn't know. Oh, look at her. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, man, the old is... trail. <laughs> okay, you. let's get down to business. You're cute and all, but just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you guys go. I can't talk. Katie, can I tell you something really quick? I have literally had a crush on you. Like oh, you, you are. You are I, I'm oh, sorry, but I'm sorry, but you have been my literally my crush for oh. forever. So I'm sorry. I had to get off that off my chest. All joking aside, just dig in a little more on your voice. I mean, yeah. don't lean on your your whole little deal. At some point, every tool you got at some point to... Well, he's to... in construction, so he's got lots of tools. Hey. What you think, Lionel? You have to have things in your arsenal. Because the competition coming out is going to be very fierce. But the wild is going to be 
Other than that, I find nothing wrong with you at all. Thank you so okay. much. No, there's nothing wrong with Thank you, you at all. Thank you, Katie. I said, Trevor, your girlfriend's out there. Oh, the girlfriend's outside. How about and, uh, we vote? Uh, yes. 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 Oh my yes. God. Yes. You're going, yes. To, You're going to Hollywood, oh Trevor. Yes. Uh, thank you guys so much. I can't thank you enough. You really teach can't. me how to be I hot really again. Can't. Oh man, wait, oh. wait, wait. Uh -oh. Howdy, howdy. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. oh Katie's there you go. out. Katie's gone. She's heartbroken. That's all right. It's all right. How are you? So he walks in. And I'm like, you're a dreamboat. Your eyes really and Katie's over there going. She, she's her eyes are doing whirly birds. Yes. What is it? <laughs> we're okay. You better so, make next time just, you see her. Yeah, yeah. We're just we're just ready. Thank, thank, thank you so much. Thank you so much. It's really great. That's great. Yes. Hi, my name is Carlito Olivero. I am 23 years old, born and raised in Chicago, Illinois, and I work at a coffee shop. Oh, yeah? You look great. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Sticker. I'm always the guy that's so happy at 5 o'clock in the morning with just chug like six espresso shots, singing my butt off, singing to customers. There's the stage. You see that? Oh, man. Now, remember, a contestant needs three yeses from the judges to get through to the next round. We're going to find a star, hopefully. How far? I'm not going to lie. I, I was confident, but now I'm just like, uh, you get this thing. I'm so blessed to even have a job, but at the end of the day, I know there's more to life than that. You watch, man. I'm going to be the Latino Chris Brown one day. You just watch. Que la que hay, mi gente! What's going on, everybody? What's going Hello. on, bro? How are you, love? Hello, mi gente, como estas? Bien, bien, mama, you said? Very well, what's your name? I'm Carlito Olivero. Carlito? And where are you from, Carlitos? Uh, born and raised in Chicago, Illinois. And who are you with here? Um, I'm here with my friends, and my family's in Chicago. And Carlito, do you work? Yes, uh, at a, I work at a coffee shop. Okay. So, like, we could write our orders down now. And... Oh, yeah, I got you. you I'll, okay, I'll, cool. I'll make Let's the mochas in the back, cappuccinos. What are you going to sing? I'm going to sing Stay by Rihanna. I like that. Good luck. I got carried away. Carlitos, I'm gonna go with Simon. Carlito. What's up, brother? Uh, <laughs> everything's good, brother. Uh, <laughs> I actually like everything about you. I like your voice. I like your charisma. Thank you, man. I think you're really good, and I, I, there's no one around like you at the moment. I just saw you from a side profile there when you were singing, and I looked to you and I thought, this kid looks like a real star. Yes. I like you. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. 
voice actually reminds me kind of a cross between Frankie J and Trey Songs. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Carnitas, I adore you. Kelly. We are witnessing a star. Carlito, it's an absolute yes. Carlitos, I'm going to say yes to. Absolutely yes. Carlito. This is a very, very, very easy yes. Congratulations. Yes! Thank you, thank you guys so much. I love you. Oh, yeah, baby! <laughs> oh, man. I, got, I didn't expect all four of them to say yes. Did I wear my nut? Did I wear... <laughs> See, now oh I'm going to be able to order the coffee and they're going to serve it to me from now on. Let's start. In the next round, the judges will be assigned a category to mentor by the X Factor producers, and already the boys category is proving popular. I'd love to have the boys. <laughs> I think that's a dangerous mix. <laughs> I've been roaming around, always looking down. Painting faces, filled in places I can't reach. You know that I could use somebody. You know that I could use somebody. Off in the night, while you live it up, I'm off to sleep. So nice. Waging the war to shake the poet and the bee. And I hope it's gonna make you notice. Oh, I hope it's gonna make you notice. Oh, someone like me. You know what, Delta, it's probably better that way. You have too many good-looking guys already on your team, it's fine. There's always room for another good-looking guy on my team. Hello. <laughs> Who are you? My name is Brock, I'm 24, and I'm from Sydney. In a word, that was quality. Really good. Uh, beautiful song, beautiful singing. You were consistent all the way through. It was difficult not to turn. Do you know what I mean? Sometimes voices are just great, and yours was great. Thank you. Well, I don't want to make you scared, but your veins are about to pop out of your muscles. <laughs> um, I thought, you know, I, I waited to the last minute because there was moments in the song that I felt like could have been better, but ultimately, like, you pulled through at the end there for me, and I was actually, like, you had me. So I was like, do I, do I not? And you, I, you made me hit my button. You demanded it, and that, that's what it's about. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. The only reason I didn't turn is I've got some really strong men in my team right now. You're strong. <laughs> How strong? No. <laughs> I mean, I kind of want to know more about you. Who are you? Tell us about, you know, your singing life. I started singing when I was 12 years old. Yep. And um, the first time I sang, the first song I wrote, the first time I publicly performed was at my mother's funeral. So... You know, it's a, it's a special thing to sing for me, and it's an expression. Um, she never knew that I, I sang. I played sport all the way through, and then as she passed away, I had an urge to pick up the guitar, sing, write, and perform, so that's why I'm here. Listen, I, I get it, um, but I understand, and when you say, like, just when you started to sing, it was the moment that I started to become a mother. I lost mine. Literally two and a half weeks after I had my son, I lost my mom. So like embracing something new in your life, like singing, that's such a beautiful gift to be able to share with the world. You know what I mean? So 
I've seen the whole world myself, you know, as, as an artist, been able to travel, been able to perform and share songs and write songs. And you just feel like you want to be in that place. And I feel like, of course, we've connected. <laughs> we deserve to work together. We really, really do. I feel like we would bring out the best in each other on this journey. Thank you. So, yeah, you just have to choose now. Delta, maybe you should stand next I'm to him. I think that's a great idea, Kelly. <laughs> and and I'll, help him make help the decision. Oh. <laughs> 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 uh, I really meant what I said, and I'm, I really am ready to take that journey with you as your coach. So am I. As am I. But I want it more. I'm gonna have to go with Kelly. <laughs> Hi. What's your name? Andrew Schultz. Wow. How old are you? I'm 18. 18. And do you work? Um, technically, I'm still a student. I graduate this Saturday. You are really handsome. You a nice you. little <laughs> corn-fed country boy. No. No. Uh, Cougar, can we get on with it? Okay. Cougar says you can sing. <laughs> Thank you. to the microphone, which made it feel a little bit karaoke. Yep. Um, you know, I felt like, yes, you, you have the appeal to the female audience. <laughs> but uh, unfortunately, I feel like you'll need more than that. Um, your voice isn't bad necessarily, but I didn't feel like you were comfortable on stage, and I felt like it was actually a bit awkward. I gotta tell you, Andrew. I disagree with all three of these girls. Well, thank you. Thank you. I do. I do. And maybe it wasn't the right song, but I thought you have a good voice with the right training. I think you'd be good. I mean, he is somebody who would be crazy to let go at this point. I genuinely believe that. Sometimes I have to disagree with you, Mr. Cowell, and um, and the audience. I apologize, but I just don't under I don't get it. Uh, what else have you got? Have you got something a little bit more old school? I have a little more you. Okay. <laughs> So why are you still standing there in the half moonlight? Come on, baby, give me a little more you. Come on, baby, give me a little more. You're bad in those baby blues, and honey, I swear.
start it off. I'll start it off by saying that that totally changed everything. Maybe that's your direction. Okay, well, let's start again. Based on that song, Pauline, do you want to say yes or no? You think you want to say yes. <laughs> Thank you. Kelly? I'll say yes. Thank you. Demi? You're not alone. I'm going to say yes. How Thank you. I would actually go more in a country direction. I think it would suit you because the first song didn't tell us the kind of artist you should be. And you look like that all-American boy. I think it, it kind of suits you, you know? But I think you've been very lucky to have me on the panel today, Andrew. Yes, I'm glad you came. I mean, it was like being mauled by three cats. But I'm going to say yes as well, so you're through to the next round. What's your name? Alexander Milosnic. And where are you from? I'm just from Stevenage. Oh, OK. <laughs> and how old are you? Uh, 23. Is it, what you're going to do, do you do it as a day job, or do you have a different job? Uh, yeah, I work for Hertfordshire Council. <laughs> how long have you been doing music for? Um, since I was around 17. Have you tried to get, like, a, a deal or something? Uh, when I was 17, 18, I did a few things. I gave it a try, and, you know, it's hard, isn't it, the industry? I'm extremely nervous because it has been a while since I've done anything on this level. I know I appear to be pretty laid back, but inside I'm like butterflies are all like, you know, not even butterflies, elephants are like stampeding everywhere and yeah. I wanna give you and baby good life. Finding out I'm gonna be a dad was obviously a massive blessing. Baby. <laughs> it's my son, you know, like it's my baby. <laughs> I hope they're all right because I think it will help a lot towards our family, you know. I obviously want to give my new family the best life I can give them, so a quarter of a million pounds would be life changing. That's why I'm here at Britain's Got Talent, for Millie and my son, and I want to make them proud. The stage is yours. Thank you, cheers. I'm gonna fight them all Seven nations army couldn't hold me back They're gonna rip it out Taking their time right behind my back And I'm talking to myself at night Because I can't forget through my mind behind the cigarette and the message coming from my phone Seven Nations Army couldn't hold me back They're gonna rip it out Taking their time right behind my back And I'm talking to myself at night Because I can't feel it Coming from my eyes Says leave it alone 
Thank you so much for watching. We hope you loved our compilation and let us know who some of your favorites are that we should feature in a compilation next. We'd love your feedback. While you're on YouTube, you should hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. This way you know each time we post a new video. Also, follow Talent Recap on all social medias. I'm talking Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. It's a good time. Plus, head over to talentrecap.com because we have all the scoop on talent shows that you won't want to miss. Hey y'all, if you're still here, either you're a hardcore fan or you have nothing else to do. Either ways, stick around. Now let me tell you a secret. You already know about, about our YouTube channel because duh, you're right here. But we also have a website with millions of visitors. It's the only website exclusively dedicated to reality TV competition shows called talentrecap.com. My name is Murganka and I'm the managing editor of talentrecap.com. My job is to work with other writers to make sure that we get you all exclusive content related to talent shows. Also, inside scoop on the judges, exclusive interviews, polls, newsletters, and fun quizzes. Now, if that sounds like your kind of thing, come visit us at talentrecap.com. Hi, I'm Samantha, and while you're still here, let me quickly tell you about our weekly talent recap show that I am one of the hosts of. Each week, two hosts sit down and discuss our favorite moments from reality talent competition shows. Think of it as a sports after show for talent competitions. We discuss the eliminations, talk about predictions for the next week, and we also talk about some of our favorite acts. It's a fun and exciting way to vent our frustrations, but also talk about some of the most epic moments on these shows. But the best part is talking to the fans. We love reading your comments and interacting with you guys and sharing some of the same emotions towards some of the acts. It's a perfect way for a fan like me to interact with a fan like you. This video's over and I didn't expect you to still be here, but since you are, let's talk more about Talent Recap and what I do here. My name is Summer Monet and I am a host for Talent Recap What's Hot. This segment is designed to take a deeper look at our favorite contestants, favorite moments, and our favorite celebrity judges. If there's any drama or controversy, you bet that we will give you the full scoop. Let me tell you some examples. All the winners of America's Got Talent, where are they now? How much money do these judges make? All the women Simon Cowell dated. And trust me, there's a lot of them and so on. I love talking to you guys, reading your feedback and your comments, so please keep them coming. I am Summer Monet, and now you know what's hot. Oh, what are you still doing here? But wait, since you've stuck around this long, hi, I'm Kayla, and I'm the director of video content here at Talent Recap. I work behind the scenes, managing our YouTube channel and editing all of our videos. At Talent Recap, we create fun and engaging videos on all of our favorite talent shows, including America's Got Talent, American Idol, The Voice, The Masked Singer, and so much more by the fans, for the fans. I personally am a huge fan of these shows, but I want to know, what are some of your favorite shows? We love to get feedback from our fans, and we love talking to you guys. Now you may have seen our talent recap show, or perhaps it was Cody Lee's unforgettable audition that caught your eye. But we've got other segments that you've got to check out, like What's Hot, Talent Reactions, Top Acts, and Red Carpet Interviews. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and ring the notification bell so that you will be notified every time we upload a video. I'm Samantha. I'm Summer Monet. I'm Kayla. And that's, and that's, and that's, our talent recap. Hey you, stop swiping on dating apps and start swiping through Talent Recap's playlists. We've got compilations, we've got red carpet interviews, what's hot videos, and recap shows. And I think it's time we take our relationship to the next level. I'm talking hit that subscribe button right now. No, I'm totally kidding. Well, I'm not kidding. You should still subscribe so you're up to date on all of our latest content. And thanks for watching.